Welcome to episode 529 of Apartment Hacker. This is Mike Bird, Apartment Hacker. It's my mission to tease out human potential in the multifamily space. First and foremost, I want to welcome uh, Diane McNeil to the Apartment Hacker Nation. Uh, welcome, Diane. I look forward to engaging with you in, at, at some point. If you have questions, just please uh, share them via the uh, message button and or email, and I will do my best to answer them in future episodes. Um, wanted to talk today about a quote that I read over the weekend, and the quote is, the soldier has the right to competent command. Um, it doesn't cite the source of that quote, so I can't attribute it to anyone. However, it, it got me thinking about um, making sure in our organizations, our property management organizations, our multifamily organizations across the country, um, about placing the right people in the right seats and get them doing the right stuff and making sure that we do um, our diligence when it comes to that. Um, that is to say that we have a mechanism in place, we have a process in place where we post positions, we actually go through a formal interview process and a rigorous one at that and uh, we have three to five potential candidates for a position and I know I can hear it now three to five, holy moly, we can't even find one, but you, you have to take time and you have to actually go through the exercise of really uh, forcing that, that process to work so that you end up with uh, competent people uh, doing uh, things in your organization. And that's not to suggest you don't have competent people in your organization doing good things already, but especially in leadership positions, I, I would go as far as to say it's every position, taking the time and investing in the process uh, and, in, and even investing in yourself, helping yourself become a better uh, interviewer, a better assessor of talent, if you will, will yield huge results down the road. Just looking at an opening and just sliding someone in there on real, on no real process, no with no real rigor. Um, my gut tells me, having spent 20 plus years in this business, um, it's not just my gut, it's just that I've seen it happen so many times where you, you slide people into positions and they're just not ready um, for what they are about to take on. Or we've not done a good job of training them up and getting them ready for those positions. Um, we might default to hey, they've been doing this particular role for this amount of time, they already know what they're doing, we just bump them up to the next level. Well, that may be true that they know what they're doing in their current level, but that next level takes on a whole other meaning and it has a whole other level of responsibilities that they may or may not have been formally trained for. So the overarching message here is make sure that you have a process in place that gets the best talent in the best seats doing the best stuff for your organization. Take care. We'll talk to you again soon.